Stopping speeders from the sky. State police are patrolling a section of Route 8 with airplanes to help crack down on reckless driving. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Hector Molina joins us with a breakdown of that operation. He is live tonight. Hector. Well, state police say that the Route 8 stretch from here in Harwinton to, Nor to Torrington has a history of serious and deadly crashes. That's why the state police's aerial team is conducting surveillance, taking a closer look to find out where and when the speeding takes place as a way to make this area safer for drivers. Route 8 from Harwinton to Torrington is a long rural stretch of road that sees high rates of speed and sometimes dangerous driving. The Connecticut Transportation Institute at the University of Connecticut says there have been 50 to 60 crashes involving injuries on this stretch of highway in the past 10 years, and about seven of them were deadly. But being a rural section of roadway where traffic volumes are probably lower, um, the, there's more opportunity for vehicles to travel at higher speeds because congestion is not um, as much as it has been. Harwinton's first selectman says it's tough having enough patrol for that area. It would be nice to see more enforcement, um, but, you know, funding is short. That's why the state police aerial team is getting a bird's eye view in their fixed wing aircraft to hone in on exactly when and where speeding is taking place. State police aren't issuing tickets or using any radar from the sky, but using the view to get a better idea of traffic trends so ground crews will know where to gather in the future. There's a lot more things that can be seen from a plane that you can see on the ground, and it's very helpful in determining those particular areas and, and comparing that to the data that we have at present in terms of what's already happened out there and what can we do to curb that from happening in the future. You want to pick the best area, the best time of day, and you want to be able to be able to collect all the data that you can in that area so that you know exactly where you want to sit to collect those tickets. However, some think drivers already obey the current patrols. But enough police presence there, they tend to slow down, you know? And what is a helicopter and what is a drone going to do? I just think that there's uh, better things they could be doing with like the time and money that this was, is probably going to cost or like other issues that should be addressed. In Harwinton, First Selected Michael Chris says that these aerial surveillances have been going on for the past two weeks. No word on when their full assessment will be completed. We're live in Harwinton tonight. Hector Molina, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.